All right, they want me to do this. Um, it's a breakfast sandwich. It's not the same one as before. Uh, for this one, we're gonna use a little bitty, uh, little bitty grill right here. That my wife just brought home. We're gonna do uh, two pieces of uh, patty sausage, uh, a little bit of uh, hard or uh, fried egg, and um, waffles for the buns. I'm gonna call it the McScuse Me. Okay, so we just started out with some regular uh, waffle mix. It's just the regular stuff you can find at the store, anybody's waffle mix. Um, if we get this going right here, we'll get a couple of these uh, waffle buns going, and then over here on the skillet, we'll get some sausage patties going, we'll fry up them eggs too. Hey, where's my sausage? Oh, your sausage Okay, oh, all right, cool. Yeah, um, forgive the mess, we're cleaning out the refrigerator. Um, Amy won't do a whole lot of home-cooked meals or anything from scratch, but she will do um, soaps, candles, ropes, and salves, ointments, gels, dyes, senses, uh, things that, uh, I don't know, it's like Amy's things and stuff. All right, so for these waffles, just use a little, little measuring cup, just a third cup, but I'm not going to use the whole thing, or maybe we're going to gauge it right here right now. First time using this little waffle iron. Maybe just brought it home, so let that sit for some seat. Okay, boom. The extreme sausage sandwich likes to have an extreme amount of sausage. This one's a little different. We're gonna go with a smaller, thinner little sausage patty. All right, let's check these bad boys. Oh yeah, perfect. Now, I didn't wanna put these warm waffle buns down on a cold plate, so I took my plate, I just microwaved it for a minute. It's not hot, but it's not cold either. Let's get another one going. I'll tell you what, a little less than a third cup worked out perfect. Down it goes. All right, let's give these a flip. Or tummy. These are a lot thinner. They're gonna go quicker. This is another quick cook, but this is just a quick breakfast. It's not really 15 minutes fridge to face. Um, you, know, you got a little more prep with the waffle buns, but uh, I think it'll be pretty quick. Oh yeah. Okay, we got enough for one. but I need about four. Enough for four breakfast sandwiches. Or four, excuse me's? Yeah. Right, these look like they're about ready to come off. Yep. All right, sausage is done. Waffle buns are almost there. I'm gonna get these eggs down. This is just not coming out fast enough. There we go. I'll tell you what, there's just something different about these homegrown eggs, man. They're a lot firmer, they cook up a lot better. Okay, these bad boys are looking just about right. One there, two, pop, three, four, get my skillet off, the heat. All right, there they are. We're gonna get a little bit of the ooey gooey cheese on this while they're still hot so they'll melt out. Serve them up for the boys and the wife and get the taste test. Here's the ooey gooey. And this could be really any cheese. It could be a, a mild Gouda. It could be an American. Um, it could be a Pepper Jack. Uh, I prefer the super easy melty ooey gooey cheese. Some would say it's not really cheese at all. In fact, I heard this stuff catches on fire if you hit it with a torch. Anyhow, 
All right, guys, this is ready to go. All right, let's do it. All right, James, get in there, man. Make that sandwich. Alexander, you're up next, my man. Where's the button? Oh, right here. Voila. Amy's dainty, excuse me. Amy gets a little mayonnaise. A little generic new name brand mustard. One piece of sausage. One really delicious egg. And the final topping. Let me excuse me. Mm, excuse me. What do you think about that bad boy, James? <laughs> All right, guys. Well, there's another quick meal, another right. breakfast sandwich. Um, this one, again, it was about 15 minutes, man, fridge to face. And here it is. If you like what you see here, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification button, and hit the comments below and let me know what kind of breakfast sandwiches you like. I'd be interested. Again, I'm always up for trying new things. I'm gonna hit this real quick. Mmm. Excuse me?